flame out. <laughs> and a mic out. Patrons of Marty's Cafe were sent scrambling into the streets when Oko's word police learn of the unofficial use of Olympic symbols. 20 people were injured, but no one had to pay for their meal. Around the world, everyone loves official Olympic mascots, Heidi and Howdy. But closer to home at a pre-Olympic event, some people were getting damn sick of them. And speaking of getting damn sick of things, it's only just begun. Trainloads of official Olympic souvenirs while quantities last. And CFCN has also climbed on the bandwagon with their own official Olympic souvenirs. Olympic sweaters, pins, and yes, now available, the official Olympic ring toss. Fun for the whole family. The gift everyone will be giving this Christmas. Meanwhile, in Greece, our official Olympic crew asked the natives if they knew where their traditional flame was on its way to. Have you heard about the Winter Olympics in Calgary, Canada? In 1988, Winter Olympics? No, you don't. Never heard of it? Nice talking to you. <laughs> you heard about the Winter Olympics in Calgary? About Winter Olympics in Calgary, Canada. I, I, I didn't hear anything. Yes. Uh, I don't know. No? No. Well, yes. in February. Okay. Calgary, Canada. Tell all your friends. You want Down to come over. We're having okay, a big we'll, party. We'll go. Yes, yes, sir. Excuse me, have you heard about the Winter Olympics coming up in Calgary? No? You know where Calgary is? Calgary, Alberta, Canada? No. No? <laughs> what do you think now, Ted? I don't think we're getting much response on this Canadian stuff. We told you that we bring our cameras everywhere. We are. Right here. Happy. And at home, official Olympic reporter Murray Dale was telling Calgarians, as if they didn't already know, how to dress for the Olympic Winter Games. We're excited. Calgary's excited. But what is burning in the minds of everyone far and wide is... You have it. The entire country right now is in an emotional catharsis. What the hell is an emotional catharsis?